the value of the exercise is to understand how relationships change when you've got motion indicators, which are these elongated forms versus static. So Stephen Imoni wants you to get this feel for relationships. The whole, whole exercise is about these relationships. Once you get it, then you can just go on into your painting again. And uh, so the idea is just to do this a few times. You don't have to do this all day, just until you understand the purpose of it. Um, Rose asked if this variation was um, to be done on a second sheet or combined on the first. Um, I think that in general, he's telling you to have, you know, to kind of do these part one and part two on a separate, you know, either individual piece of paper, one, one for each little collection of three. Uh, obviously, when I did this on the large canvas this morning, I started with like isolated three uh, shaped areas, but then it, it morphed into something else. So what you kind of based on your space and what you have and what you want to do, but I would say the most important thing is to keep to the three shapes initially, just to get used to like, how do you feel? How do you feel? Ask yourself the questions that are listed in Tina's handout. That's very important. Like, you know, do you have different feelings? Like what are, what does this make you feel like when you've got, you know, elongated versus static? Um, this one's the odd man, odd man out here. This is the oddball here. Uh, this one is, uh, you know, it's, it's on its corner here, which makes it feel like it's kind of falling into these two shapes. But, you know, the clear directional movement is coming from these guys. So the idea, again, this is you, what you're doing is you're building your language and your ability to describe things in your own work, starting with these super simple, only three shaped compositions. That's really what they are. Okay, any other questions? Okay, if not, we'll keep painting and I'm going to move into obliterating. I think if I can get away with it, I think my paint's dry already. Just the beauty of acrylic. So, Lisa, I'm going to ask you to keep my two camera views um, spotlighted just because okay. I'm going to keep up a couple, probably two videos. Yes, I have them both spotlit.